Hey everybody, I usually don't do these videos back to back, but there was one more thing that uh, I wanted to fill everybody in on. Uh, we're actually located in the state of Illinois, that's uh, where we operate from. And you can kind of see the mess on the desk back there, maybe I'll turn this a little bit more like that. There, there we go. See how messy I am. At any rate, uh, a lot of things have changed here in Illinois with new legislation lately, and one of the new things that uh, just went into effect uh, a little later this summer, I think right around the end of July, that I know, again, a lot of employers aren't even aware of yet, uh, is something actually, it's based in a little bit of sadness, but it is very helpful uh, from the state, uh, as a matter of fact, and it is the Child Bereavement Leave Act. Uh, it covers a sad situation wherein, you know, employees of public or private employers who, uh, wherein the employers have 50 or more employees. They do have to have 50 or more employees for this to uh, be in, in place, uh, for you to be legislated under this. Um, those employees, and there are some additional criteria they then have to meet after you having 50 or more employees, those employees are now entitled to a maximum of two weeks or 10 work days of unpaid bereavement uh, time following the death of a child, which is phenomenally sad. I don't even want to try to wrap my head around that. I've got kids of my own. In fact, one of them, way over there, works with us. Hey, Coates. <laughs> Which is awesome. I love getting to do that. Um, at any rate, uh, in the event that more than one child dies uh, during a 12-month period, those employees would be entitled up to six weeks of bereavement time. Uh, as well. And again, this is unpaid bereavement leave. There are some additional things that go along with this. I'd encourage you to go ahead and go to Illinois.gov to the IDOL uh, laws and rules pages and look that up. It's, it's fairly short. It's pretty concise. Uh, but it would be a good thing if you have 50 or more employees to update your policies to include that now. Uh, and again, as always, with these and other HR issues, give us a call. We'd love to help. Thanks and have a great day.